narito naman ang mga experiences ng mga pasyente na nag-i-inject ng glutathione. Malaki ang naitulong ng glutathione sa akin. To tell you the truth, uh, it is a lifesaver sa akin. Uh, it is a, the last kawakat, the last uh, active ingredient na nakapagbabago sa buhay ko. Yun ang kagandahan ng glutathione. Next to God and my, my doctor, it was glutathione that helped me out. I am now using uh, the glutathione once every week, but two shots. And for your uh, information, I have been using it already for almost two years. And it will become a lifetime uh, part of my life. Every, every week, I <laughs> uh, It was a second life for me. Uh, next to God and my doctor, Lutatayon helped me out. tulong na IV glutathione sa aking anak. Dahil dun sa kanyang ano, bukol sa kanyang leg, uh, naghilom yung kanyang mga bukol. Dahil ang sabi ng doktor na pinagpating na namin sa kanya, uh, high grade malignancy at high grade sarcoma ang kanyang sakit. Twice a week po siyang tinuturo ka ng gluta. Man Monday tsaka Saturday. Malaki ang pagbabago talaga. Pati yung kanyang bibig, tsaka injection niya ng ano, yung vitamin C. Twice a uh, week din. Kasi yung kanyang bibig, nag ano, nag babakbak. Maano na siya ngayon, malaki ang kanyang pinagbago tsaka talagang maano na siya. Medyo pasaway na na uli eh. At dahil nga kontrobersyal, kailangan meron tayong lawyer's opinion regarding legal matters. Uh, actually, wala namang particular na batas na nagsasabi na bawal ang mga doktor mag-inject ng glutathione. Kasi ang um, glutathione naman kasi is not listed as a dangerous or prohibited drug dun sa list na nilabas ng Philippine Drug Enforcement Agency. Kaya pwedeng i-inject ng doktor. Ngayon, kahit pa ba sabihin na hindi siya registered sa BFAD, ang rule kasi is kung ang gamot, eh, kung ang component naman yan, eh, uh, dito sa local use, eh, approved naman yung paggamit, kagaya ng vitamin C. May mga locally manufactured vitamin C na ini-inject na gawa ng mga local manufacturers at inaalaw naman yon eh, there's no reason na, na yung imported na vitamin C eh hindi mo pwedeng i-inject. Uh, uh, dahil nga doon sa, sa, sa basic rule na hindi naman siya listed as dangerous and prohibited drug. Ang uh, function ng board na yan, siyempre, is to see to it that the doctors are not engaging in illegal activities like, for example, abortion or uh, yung uh, euthanasia. Pero in, when it comes to uh, the decision on what drug to use to sa patients nila, as long as hindi prohibited and dangerous drug yung ina-administer nila, hindi naman sila pwedeng kasuhan. Lalo na kung ang gamot naman, eh, hindi naman bago o kaya yung component ng gamot, eh, dati nang ina-accept dito sa atin, tapos nagkaroon lang ng halimbawa isang uh, imported brand, brand names, Uh, nakapareho din ang component ng gamot at dinala dito at in-inject nila, hindi sila pwedeng kasuhan. Glutathione, an excellent antioxidant, will provide significant health benefits when used for its main indication. We, the doctors, the Department of Health, the Food and Drug Administration will work together in protecting the people from harm. However, one piece of advice, if you want to get glutathione injections, please go to your doctor. This is Generation RX, your health and travel show on TV that keeps you informed. Now signing off.